Well, congrats to Bo Nix on his first NFL win. Rookie quarterbacks now 4-5 and five on the season. Not terrible. The Broncos, they went into Tampa Bay and kicked their feet up and ate a sandwich, in the, in the words of Chris Broussard. Man, Denver, looking good, is the Broncos. I feel like Denver's going to be frisky this year. I think Bo Nix, he's already showing a lot of improvement. He's running the ball well, too, which is something that I wasn't sure if we'd see him be super mobile. He looks mobile. He looks accurate. He hasn't thrown a touchdown pass yet. I think that that will come. But Denver now has a nice win under their belts, and and Tampa's a good team, I think. Um, although they looked pretty bad at home against a, a Broncos team that was winless. So we'll see about that. But either way, congrats to to Denver. Yeah, Tampa. I mean, look, they had a chance if they could if they beat Denver, they'd have been three and zero. They led the division. And they could pretty clearly say, like, we're one of those top dogs in the, in the NFC. Instead, it, it's, again, it's the, it's the whole reason why I said I'm never going to be able to f- truly take Baker Mayfield seriously because every about once a month at least he has a game like this where he just disappears. Like, you can't be a top 10 quarterback when once a month you, you just don't show up. When when Baker's on, he's great. When Baker's off, he's terrible. And he's he's inconsistent like that. And it sucks that he's inconsistent because I think everybody kind of wants to root for the guy, but he needs to prove himself a little bit more before I can go that far on the Baker Mayfield train. 